Our epidemiological investigations have identified that most of the cases in this cluster have visited multiple KTV uh, clubs and outlets, multiple visits to several KTV outlets on the same day, or multiple days. I'd just like to add to what our Director of Medical Services has said. Uh, there was an article in the uh, Straits Times discussing the uh, butterfly effect and how it has contributed to the current cluster we have here. I'd just like to address that analogy a little bit. In the industry, uh, the uh, social hostesses are sometimes referred to as butterflies because uh, they will visit uh, multiple different rooms within the, the lounge and uh, service different patrons in different rooms. For the purposes of illustration, we will refer to the patrons as uh, flowers. Let's call the room that they are in the flower bed uh, and that would make the KTV lounge a uh, garden. So essentially what happens is that the butterflies will uh, go to uh, one of the flower beds and uh, visit uh, some of the flowers there. Some of the flowers will uh, <coughs> uh, request to have their nectar sucked uh, and that doesn't always happen because uh, the nectar is not very sweet to be honest. And then the uh, butterfly will proceed to move to different flower beds uh, where the cross-pollination might occur and that's where we run the risk of uh, the spread that we are seeing. Uh, the problem becomes more complicated because some of these butterflies don't limit themselves to one garden. Uh, some of these butterflies will uh, visit multiple different gardens, uh, either within the same night or over a period of a few days. The flowers are no less uh, and sometimes they will visit multiple different gardens, uh, thus again contributing to uh, the exponential spread. What you can say is that the butterflies, the flowers and the gardeners, they have all come together to royally screw up our entire ecosystem and that is very disappointing. Um, moving forward, uh, a lot of these butterflies are going to be sent back to their cocoons. As for the gardeners, uh, a lot of them will have their gardening licenses revoked. Uh, some of them might have to move into greenhouses to survive. As for the flowers, we urge you, if you've been to any of these gardens in recent times, please do come forward to get yourself tested. I understand there's a fear of being exposed. I understand you are afraid that uh, your partners may chop off your stem or rip out your fruits if uh, they find out that you've been to these gardens. But uh, for the greater good of the entire ecosystem, please come forward and get tested. Uh, Yikang, anything to add?